All right, welcome back. I have an update, a long-term update for you guys. You might recall I've been running Ubuntu 16.04 and Ubuntu Mate. Ubuntu 16.04, I ran it initially as a test on this rather outdated machine here. It's pretty solid, but it's only a dual core, of four gigs of RAM as you see here. Initially, I had only a lot of 25 gigs. Uh, strictly for testing purposes, but I kept using this more and more and I like it. So finally last night I started over, I deleted it, uh, installed it. Uh, this time I, I allotted almost 200 gigs of space on the hard drive, reinstalled it. This has been impressive, at least in my machine. Uh, your mileage may vary as they say, but in my machine almost everything works 99.9% .9 of the apps I use work which is pretty good for a Linux distribution in my test about the only thing that doesn't work is an app called radio tray uh, you can see here to the left it's flashing like it wants to start <clears throat> and uh, it doesn't do anything uh, I installed something else I think stream streamer something to listen to the online radio it's no big deal but Radio Tray is the only thing that does not work on this machine. Everything else works. There are no crashes, no freeze-ups. I am extremely impressed. Now, this is the install of the latest uh, 16.04.1 release on my machine. And so far, it's running really good. And I'm going to give this a recommendation, at least for you, to try as one of the best Linux operating systems for 2016. So for me at least, good job Ubuntu. Finally, don't forget to vote for the best Linux operating system, the best Linux distribution for 2016 based on you, not on me. Please use the link below in the show notes because I can keep track of this. Now, if these choices here, Ubuntu, Linux Mint, Arch, Manjaro, Zorin, Debian, Ubuntu Mate, if you like none of these, that's okay. Post, go to the link, either vote for this or just make a comment below as a vote for your favorite distribution. As you can see here, there are no clear winners. The most votes goes for Debian so far. Uh, but this poll ends on November 13th in about two and a half weeks. So if you have something to say about the best Linux OS, it does not necessarily have to be about technology. So that's entirely up to you. What you think is the best Linux distribution for um, for 2016. Okay, well that's all I have for this one. Uh, if there's something that you would like me to take a look at, let me know. As always, enjoy your technology and please don't text and drive.